Place is for scene two, people remember. Once Puck gives you the pansy serum, you have to really sell that you're transforming into a zombie. Excellent work, Miss Valentine. Excellent, but Chloe's terrible. She never remembers her. Mr. Ace, you can't let anyone drink from that beaker. Don't be silly. It's more than safe. I should know. I tried it myself. Up, up, down, down, left, right, A. I have to get out there. I can't let you do that, Jeremy. Mr. Reyes? You needy, pathetic, self-centered students. You think I wanted to teach high school drama in New Jersey? My script says I can go all the way to Broadway. I just have to keep you from ruining my big night. You're going to squip the whole cast. Uh, that's just for starters. That's not what I wanted. It's the only way to achieve what you want. Well, I'll fight back. Uh, alcohol messes you up, right? Uh, I'll get drunk. And I'll be back when you're sober. Unless you plan on staying wasted forever? You're a computer. There has to be a way to turn you off. I would stop there. You don't want to end up like Rich. Rich? What did he... It. Green Mountain Dew activates you. Red shuts you off. Why do you think we had it discontinued? To get rid of me now, you'd need a time machine to the 1990s. Or a friend who's so old school, he buys 90 soft drinks from the back room at Spencer's Gifts. <gasps> Too bad you don't have one of those anymore. Michael! Call Michael! I'm going to improve your life, Jeremy, if I have to take over the entire student body to do it. Michael makes it entrance! <laughs> Michael! I was just in the audience thinking, this is pretty good for a school play. Then I was like, this is way too good for a school play! They've all been squipped, right? Wait, wait you came to see me in the play? He even brought my own refreshments! Ah! Is that? Mountain Dew Red! Told you I did my research! Oh, hey, Jake! This is gonna sound weird, but if I hold down Jeremy, can you make him drink this Mountain Dew Red? Actually, that doesn't sound weird at all. Up, up, down, down, left, right, A. <laughs> I was already pretty boss before. Now I'm totally boss and then some more. I'm living the opera. You broke my heart and slept with my best friend. And I'm not mad you dated my best friend and wouldn't sleep with me. He didn't sleep with you? No. He didn't sleep with me? No. Oh my god, why was I so jealous of you? You were jealous of me? That's the nicest thing you've ever said to me. Sisters forever. Jinx. Ugh. Michael, the bottle. There's still a few drops left. How am I supposed to get past them? Apocalypse of the Damned. Level 9. The Cafetorium. Got it. Find the bad guy, push him aside, then move on forward with your friend at your side. It's a two-player game, so when they make an attack, you know you got a brother gonna have your back. Then you stay on track, and I remain on course, and if they give you a smack, you got you use your force. And if you leave your brother behind, it's lame, cause it's an effed up world, and it's a two-player game. Hey! I know what you're doing, Michael. I know what everyone's doing. All the time! I just feel so connected to you guys right now. Ugh, you don't want to drink that, Jeremy. Why not? Because then you'll never be with her. You are the person I want to be with every day. And this is something that I've been afraid to say. That is not Christine. I assure you, it is. Only her fears and insecurities have been removed. You're the guy I am so kinda into. Into. Guy I am totally into. This feeling is new. Jeremy, I love you. That's 
your cue. She'll do whatever I want. That's what I promised. Great. Drink this. Wait. 